back to Pokemon Emerald last time because these guys are hopefully battle take these up. Those people, those kids are gonna death on me. Literally. Man, I'm so glad I got that over So now we have to defeat it, we probably will spoil it our next objective. It's actually to go and visit the um, space station. What's going on here? As you remember, we left that letter, letter saying that Team Magma was going to take, pay a visit to the, to the space station and steal the, uh, the space fuel and they begged us to not bother them. So we're going to do the opposite of what they want us to do and we're going to go and bother them. Now I know they want to bring us to the this before. Um, this right here, spaceship, that's a really important piece of history for me and it's not because I want to be an astronaut, it's because um, when I play this game, I got Emerald, this spaceship was there. Now, I I am really gullible, well, I was really gullible back then, and what it was is when I read somebody in here, someone's just going to tell you um, that they're launching a spaceship. Now, that automatically let me know that there's a possibility that, um, some of these here is a possibility that we can actually go up in space. Now, because this is a Pokemon up there called Deoxys, which you're going to get in an event. And, um, let's see here, who's going to use the battle? I really do need to level up snow with the low here, so we, you know what? Screw that. Experience, instead we'll give it more experience, so it'll get a chance to level up. So now we're gonna go and um this course. I'm gonna keep on ranting about this spaceship now while I'm leveling up snow globe. Um, now, snow globe uh dang, why is it snow globe man? I also learned out that actually the type that name that the name of the admin that was the female admin for this group. It actually turned out to be Courtney, but back to my rank. Now, like I said before, I was really global, and I believed that you could go in space, so I made sure that I came back every day, every uh, every day of the week, to see and get the spaceship. What happened is, apparently, I learned I learned this, is that, um, you cannot... The spaceship is not for you to ride, it's more of a how much time you spent playing the game, sort of thing. Now, you can imagine my disappointment when I found it out recently. And I'm kidding you, I found it out recently. Like, I am really mad that, that even happened. Like, I mean, I spent almost all my time playing this game for that specific purpose. Like, I didn't know about, I didn't know about, like, I didn't, I did not know about events. I did not know about status and functions. I did not know about, <laughs> I did not know about events. I didn't even know that there were such things as Pokemon events. I was not, I was a Pokemon fan, as you, as you recall. My very first Pokemon game was Ruby. So, a lot of this was pretty new to me, and I was just like, I mean, my my like, it was not a, it was not a painful part of my past. I would honestly say it was like one of the most disappointing parts of my past because I really wanted to go into space, and I don't know. I've been hearing a lot. I've been hearing a, about a lot of glitches lately, and I'm probably gonna hurt myself here, aren't I? Darn it! Why did I keep on hitting myself? And he wants to save my snow globe, and he's going to cause death to himself by having to be inflict slash into that. Okay, and I got a critical. I'm not gonna complain about that. Um, okay, fire fuel. Really? What is that? Okay, that was the outside. Oh, sorry about that, folks. <laughs> You probably know what I'm talking about. I'm hearing a really random sound right now, and it's not pleasant. Okay. Uh, let's see what you got up here. Uh, have you seen a lot of team team I work up here? We don't need to necessarily battle these people, but I'm gonna battle these guys, and after this one, I'm gonna start cutting them out because, well, actually, never mind. There's actually in them. Uh, is the admin on this on this level? No, the admin is not on this level. Okay, never mind. I will be cutting. I'll be cutting out every single level. Um, game. I'll be cutting out every single. Uh, <coughs> Dang it! I'll be cutting out every single the battle out here as soon as I get done with this. Okay. This one is more defensive than that, but Gary, we should have used sneaky treachery. Yeah. Um. So we're not gonna be cutting away. Okay. After those are battles, I want to see something over here. Um. Let's get the, it's over. Still, still over here. The intent to steal those is still over here. They, you know, I thought they would have been more tiny about that and, um, no, it went off and, uh, what just happened? Why can't I get by you? 
What happened? Hold up. Why can't I? Is this a glitch? Are you serious? Ah, oh, I'll be right back. I this glitch is fixed. Okay, I don't know what was up with that. Like, I, he's never done that before. And we got an ambush. What's wrong with you? You're at number three to one, but you still want to take us on? Yes, I do. Eric, let's go get it, are you? Okay, I'll go first. And instead of triple battling me in this game, they, they throw they throw a ball at us. They decided to go at us one on one with one Pokemon each. Now, um, this is this is another this is a, this is something for you kids to learn. Anytime you want to bully somebody out of lunch money, you should not try to take the lunch money one on one. Take it all, jump the kid and take his lunch money and dip. Um, I, I do not condone violence. I'm just saying, if you really want to be able to make sure you get what you want, outnumber them, and don't do it like these idiots. Seriously, I just completely own everyone. Like, well, I want to have the zip back. What do you got? What do you got? What do you got? A money in it? You got money in it? Like, all, all I have to do is just freaking hit you with a... It's like I said, I just never did that. Like, we don't have Pokemon. This is like one thing I really, really, I really find this fun with this team. They could have went so much. They could have done so much better with this organization. They... They're more, they're, in my opinion, they're way more threatening than Team Aqua, and and I say this because I'm not a huge fan of Team Aqua. Then because like I mean, I mean I know all freaking organizations are hypocrites in, in a way, and they're like the, like the hypocrites and freaking Pokemon Black and White, but they were a huge hypocrite, and we got critical hit there. And I will say this like I mean they could have done so much better when with how, what Pokemon they had, they could have had way more uh, Fire Pokemon on their team. I mean, if they were allowed to, and I know there's actually freaking Pokemon other regions they could have freaking had, I mean, they could have had freaking Charizard. That would have shocked me. That really would have shocked me with that one if you had Charizard. And this is something that I really wish Tabitha would have, you know, employed in his team was to have a Charizard. But, um, as you see, these guys know that's smart, it's best not to give them ideas because of some ideas. They start falling in, they start falling in like ideas. If only you weren't at park ground. Man, hey, Sandstorm, man. And I think I'm a, I think about Pokemon in general, in, in anime, I want to say. Is it just me, or is it that every time Pokemon uses a move, each Pokemon has a variation of how they perform the move? Like, like for instance, Balatoy. Balatoy, when he uses Sandstorm in the anime, he freaking spins on his, on his, uh, on his toy, like, leg of his. Like, is that, is that just me, or is that weird, and... Why would Team Magma want to steal our rocket fuel in the first place? I don't know. Team Magma, did he want to go what did he want to go on space too? I don't know. If Team Magma takes the rocket fuel, I won't be able to go to space. I can't be allowed to give him this outrage. And old man, I don't care. So now, um please you beat these guys, now it's time for us to go and Hey Steven, what's he doing up here? Team Magma. What's the point of stealing rocket fuel? Since you're a curious, curious, you deserve an explanation. We're, we're going to jettison the entire load into, uh, into Mount Chimney. Which grind on down and all you need for that slack heap on mountain. So we use the fuel's power to make the camera erupt. They will be savage. And he is so disgusted at his plan that he literally jumps back a couple of spaces. And sure, why not? Um, this is the first instance of a, of a two, pay, two players being on the same team in the battle. So we're going to... We're going to go and send in Steven, and we're probably going to need Pimpin for this. Enter. Uh, I don't know why I enter freaking, uh... And we get the last bit of intro music we're going to get for, um, battle music for, uh... Freaking Team Magma. I love this music, man. I'm telling you, I'm a huge fan of this music. They have the best intro. I mean, they have the best freaking... Theme music, man. And we see Tabitha. Another thing, a lot of people have been saying that he's gender confused. I would put it past him. So I, I, like, I am honestly really wondering why they named him Tabitha in English. Like, I mean, what was his name in freaking Japanese? I wonder. I probably should know that because I freaking LP in this game. But I don't, I don't know that. So we are going to surf these guys up. And since surf the only person was to put one on, on the opponent's to put one. It's perfect. That's his character, Tabitha's camera ups. Now, Tabitha will probably be the easier of the two, while... 
And another thing with this game, I don't know where it is with this one, but the tank seems to gain experience in this fight. This is the only this is, this is the only time this actually happens in the Pokemon game. I don't know why they did this. This is the only time in the in, in the game that uh the, the electric partner in the battle of the computer, the CPU itself gets experience for the Pokemon. Now, I don't know why they scripted this in here. I know it's scripted because there's no way, there's no way that they would have gotten experience from that. Uh, okay here, um, we should probably use Circle. I plan on using Ice Beam and thank goodness they didn't use that on, on a, uh, uh, Helper. Ugh, that would have, that would have been bad for me. You know what's kind of funny? Oh, thank you, Steven. You know what would be kind of funny for this? If I'm... Oh my goodness. Doesn't affect me. <laughs> Doesn't affect me. Steven is immune to your ground moves, and I'm slowing down the camera up. That's not good. Doesn't affect Go, but of course, because it doesn't affect Go. Go's part flying. That's. I guess that's the best tycoon I should be poisoned and also be flying. So you have the ability to levitate over those over Earth moves that are really powerful against you. But it also does make you um, um, vulnerable to. Uh, of, uh, to rock type moves. Another thing I, I haven't brought this up yet is, um... Oh my goodness, it's a Crobat. Um, why haven't I moved yet? It's weird. Uh, I'll be nice being on uh, Crobat here. And another thing I haven't brought this up is, uh... What was I gonna bring up? Okay, uh... Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Uh... If one, if one confused Pokemon was enough, it had to be two of them! Of course! Of course, I get the short end of the stick. You know what, Steven? I hope your Pokemon dies. I honestly do. Cause it needs to die. And my attack got lowered, even though it doesn't matter because it's, it's not a physical attack. Uh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, thank goodness it didn't hurt. So now, Salmon just does the Crobat. Who's two lows? I have ahead of me. And I didn't... Oh, great. I think he's ice cream with you. And he's using mean look. Why would you use mean look? It's like, it's like, it's like, shooting yourself in the crotch and then saying it didn't hurt. Oh, you didn't mean to. When the gun was literally pointed at your crotch. I, I don't know how that made sense, but oh, oh, that didn't. And how is that gonna, like, that thing's freaking defensive. I mean, you lucky you didn't take any work wall damage from that, and I'll probably hit me somewhere like, no, why not? Okay, never mind then! Okay. I'll take that. I'm not gonna make you play. This third, surprisingly, not doing much damage to me. I tell you, that's like... And... Why would you just take down a freaking med tank, man? And, what is that? Wow, that says Gantum backwards. His... Uh, <laughs> med tank's... Back, back, name backwards doesn't mean anything, but I... I don't know what it is to mean, but when names being backwards, but I'm telling you. All I want, I just want to expand the land mass! Voice crack. I'm a world leader! Hey, 5,120 HP. I mean, thank you, man. <laughs> HP. If one of those was currency, we'd all be rich. But, um, uh, we got some money for that. We failed to... We failed to make the volcano erupt. We failed to control ground after all. Yeah, we're gonna. It. It's our goal to expand the land. Uh, Misguided. It. If if we team mad more wrong, then might team Aqua's goal also to expand the sea be equally misguided? All right, we'll give up on the field. There are plenty more important matters than that I must examine. You yeah, that was too that was too tense. Jeremy, thank you. I have something to give you guys. Thanks for your support. Please come see me after all this. Oh yes, I don't live in Rustbrook City. I live, I live right here on this island. Now, I don't know why he brought up that he don't, live, he doesn't live in Rustbrook City. I'm guessing, cause I, oh that's right, because he's making reference to his father. If you haven't made the connection yet, Steven is freaking. Oh yeah, the kid, he was on the freaking. Oh man, I sure hope I don't have to see him when I play again tonight. Okay, I think the houses are down here. Not really in circles, man. I think running circles, man. Run in, 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 and I'll be right back. Okay, now if you haven't noticed by now, his house is right here, because you go in these other houses, they're really not important. Oh, that's another thing, I think it's right here. Um, I'm, I brought up the second bases, I can be explored by somebody. Here he is, this kid, will literally, I give him a second base, and you come talk to him. He will go find a second base. Now, when you come back to him, he will tell you 
the location that you should your face. Now you probably say, what kind of use would that be? Well, I think that that right there is a good is a good way to find your second base if you happen to lose it. Now, um, second bases also have another use 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 in the fact that you can um, trade data in that person's game, and you can find their second base in your game, and you can explore it and everything. And I think you can battle them if they're inside uh, the base. If the sprite is so, um, if you get us TM dive now. This actually allows us to backtrack and do a bunch of other extra stuff. So yeah, we're not done with backtracking because... Back to, do I really need to go over there? Because I don't think I have any use for anything over there. Um... Yeah, but okay, now, I want to go backtrack to the, to the, um... To the ship because I don't need anything over in that abandoned ship now. If, if there was a spot down there that had dark... That had a dark, um, like, patch in the water. Now, and this is me talking about a green Pokemon flying over Pacific Log Town, uh, Town that we're going to be needing to visit soon enough because of the, our next destination. But uh, like I said, um, now there's actually a, a, a dark spot in the water that uh, that we can dive, we can use dive in. So you're probably going to why would we want to go down there? Well, if you have if you have any Pokemon that evolves to a water stone, you can find a, a water stone down there. But since I don't have any Pokemon that evolve that way, which is why I, which is why I, I usually avoid that. To be completely honest, but I don't like I don't like having to go out of way to find these stones to evolve them. Also, unless I'm dealing with Eevee. But yeah. So now we are free to do what we want, and but there's another thing I gotta bring up. Now Team Magma brought up something about Team Aqua is um what they're doing is wrong. So we want what we wanna do is we wanna go and do that, um deal with Team Aqua. But also deal with another couple of things that we're, is, we're gonna need to deal with that's gonna evolve a Really for getting interesting side quests, so I'm back to get back to Monster Steve because I want to see anything on my, my PC. So I can, uh, I can use the HM Slave. Um, I doubt it though, but uh, if I actually want to one, this would be easier to, to do. But uh, yeah, so I don't have anything, so, so I don't have anything I can use on that, uh, it's like a water type. Uh, I'll probably end up right here, folks, so next time on Pokemon Rook and Rook. We're gonna go and explore a couple of things we have we can do now that we have the use of HM Dive. And I'll probably go on off screen to find a water Pokemon that I can use to, to use dive, so I'll be seeing you guys then and I hope you're enjoying your day.